Today, we're checking out the stunning and historic Battle House Hotel Renaissance in Mobile, Alabama. Trust me, this place is absolutely amazing. Let's go explore. First stop is the lobby. Just look at this rotunda domed glass ceiling. Isn't it incredible? It's like walking into a palace. The Battle House Hotel has been around since 1852 and you can feel the history in every detail. The four corners of the lobby represent the rulers of Alabama, France, England, Spain, and the U.S. 1852, the Battle House Hotel opened by James Battle with 200 rooms. The Crystal Ballroom is also the location of the very first Mardi Gras Ball in 1852, and it also has a ghost. It's said that a newlywed couple was living here when the husband left on a business trip and never returned. Legend has it that the bride was so heartbroken that she jumped from the balcony and unalived herself from the crystal chandelier. This is called the Whispering Arch. This arch is famous for letting whispers travel over 35 feet. It's said that reporters used to sit here and catch all the juicy stories from people on the other side. Let's give it a try. One interesting thing about it is uh, there's stories that uh, Congressman Ford was here one time in the and he sat on the chair right next to you right now. By me, there were a couple of reporters who listened to this conversation. A lot of times, he was going to be public news, which would be here every time because of the arch. Thanks, Tristan. The hotel completely burned down in 1905 and was rebuilt and opened again in 1908. And Elvis Presley actually stayed here in 1952. In 1974, a very sad day happened because the hotel was closed and locked their doors. But in 2007, it was restored and opened to its former glory. Connecting to the hotel is the RSA Battle House Tower, which is the tallest building in Alabama at 40 stories high. Across the lobby is the trellis room. This is the hotel's elegant Italian restaurant. The glass ceiling is a Tiffany glass skylight, and it gives the room an open, airy feel. You can enjoy breakfast, lunch, or dinner here. Need to unwind? There's a roof garden terrace that you can have some stunning views of downtown Mobile, along with a beautiful swimming pool, pickleball courts, and a top-notch fitness center along with a spa. Whether you're looking to stay active or just relax, I think you're going to find everything you need. I know this sounds like an advertisement, but it really is not. I was able to stay here using Marriott Bonvoy points, and you can too. Also, if you like videos like this, don't forget to smash that like button and subscribe to see more. Now let's take a tour of one of the rooms. I was able to stay in room 6108, and this is in the old historic part of the building. This king room was super cozy and packed with lots of charm. The bathroom has a separate shower, a one sink vanity, and a bathtub with that decorative wallpaper along with the toilet. As we open the closet door, it's extra deep, perfect for stashing your luggage, and comes with all the essentials, an ironing board, hangers, and safe. The TV is on top of a cabinet with drawers for extra storage, a coffee maker, and there's a mini fridge. Everything you need for a comfortable stay. Here's that comfy king size bed, a nice desk, but the best part is this wonderful view of Royal Street. Another great feature is how close this hotel is to other restaurants and nightlife on Dolphin Street. Watch out for my video on places to eat in downtown Mobile and tag along with me on a Bienville Bites food tour. Thanks for joining me and I hope that you subscribe and like this video. Safe travels!